So here is the single touring seat with the white cowl on the back uh, to give it that real cafe racer style on the Continental GT. Um, really nice seat, very comfortable uh, and well made as well. I'll make sure I put links in the description so you can purchase one if you want to. Um, so let's just show you what this is all about. If I flip it over a moment. On the back, you've got the attachment hooks, which just hook underneath the tank to put it in place. And then you've got the little locking nut, like a boot of a car that pushes down into a hole and locks in place. Uh, the rear cowl doesn't come attached. It comes separate in the box. And sometimes you have to buy the seat and the cowl separately and they come in different colors. Uh, and these have just got some little torque screws. There's three of them one on each side and one in the middle at the back uh, and they're quite easy to put into place uh, you can bend this out ever so slightly to fit it around the back of the seat as you do them up but once you've got one in the whole thing becomes really easy it takes a couple of minutes just to put those into place uh, the other thing you've got is this gap here which I feel is a bit like wasted space. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put in either an extra toolkit or maybe something like this, which is a fold up backpack, because let's face it, we don't want to carry a backpack when we're riding. But sometimes when you go shopping, that'd be nice to do just so you can take the seat off, grab your little backpack and put your shopping in it. And maybe just put a little Velcro tab in here so that the it will stay in place and not move about. Obviously, it's going to be well protected from the elements in there and it's not going to do any harm to your bike. Okay, so the Continental GT that I've got has got a touring dual seat on it. So one that came with the bike, really comfortable. I believe this is an upgrade, this seat. Uh, but if you want it to look like the cafe racer that the Continental GT should be, it needs a single seat and a cowl. Luckily on these bikes, it's super easy to switch them over. So what we're going to do is just going to go down to the side panel and we're going to unlock it lift up at the bottom and then gently give it a wiggle from the top and away it comes and you will find the toolkit and next to the toolkit there's a little pull handle so you just pull this out which you'll hear a click and then the seat simply lifts away from its locking mechanism and off it comes so this is the beauty of the system that it's really quick to change over so you don't have to do undo screws and you know take loads of time out when doing this type of thing so what we're going to do is now fit the second seat which is the single which i've got here under the front just have to hook in front hooks I sometimes find that when the seats get hot, they expand slightly and they don't quite fit. You need to give them a little bit of a push. And now, click. That's in place, ready to go. Replace the side panel, lock it up, and you're good to go. Push in place, push in, Turn the key, that's it. Single season cowl fitted to the Continental GT 650 from Royal Enfield, absolutely gorgeous. I will put the uh, link in the description for this seat from the seller I bought it from, they were fantastic. So remember folks, if you're a fan of the Royal Enfields, the Interceptors or the Continental GTs, please subscribe to this channel, support it, and I'll bring you more videos of these amazing bikes um, on the road in the UK. I'd love to hear your feedback. Um, get in touch, leave a comment, and I'll do my best to answer them all.